Hi, a sexy viscous, and welcome into Kingdom Come Deliverance four years later. So every year I've, I've looked at Kingdom Come Deliverance, and um, this year I, I have nothing. I started writing some notes for this video. Um, hang on. Right. <laughs> That's a good one, that one. Um, uh, no, the rest are empty. There is one, one note here. It says, Kingdom Come Soap. Kingdom Come Deliverance Soap Bar, which should <laughs> oh, give wow. you the real medieval smell. In that case, I must say, it actually, medieval smells actually pretty well. It's and a uh, To say this year had been a bit lackluster would be an understatement. In fact, exactly one year ago today, I said this. We're at the point now, three years after release, where it's very likely that we're going to be getting some information on something coming soon this year. By the time I make Kingdom Come Deliverance four years later, there's probably been an announcement for a sequel. <laughs> Hang on a minute. Oh, right, okay. On the footnote, like in tiny writing, it says don't forget to mention the comic book. There's a comic book that got announced that I'm actually really excited about. That's it, though. You know, I, I used to enjoy making these videos when there was actually something to talk about. And by my estimations, I can assume that by the time that I'm making my Kingdom Come Deliverance five year later video, that we'll have heard something. I'm just going to preface next year's video by saying this. <laughs> Idiot. Look here, Warhorse Studios. It's safe to say, People want a sequel. All I hear about every single day is Where's Kingdom Come 2? Roxy, you know everything. When's it coming out? Roxy, have you played it yet? Roxy, are you in it? No, I'm not in it because it doesn't exist. Supposedly, legally, it doesn't exist. It does, it blatantly does, but Warhorse Studios hasn't said bugger all. And as a fan of this brilliant bloody game, I want to see a sequel. Honestly, at this bloody point, I take a battle royale. Something, Warhorse. Just release something. No, not a soap holder. Look, just something game related, please. And you can tell I'm getting passionate about this because I bloody love this game. Uh, oh, hang on, a piece of paper is on the floor. Hang on. <coughs> what is this? Oh, oh, yes. Uh, the Amorous Adventures of the Bulls Her Hands is free right now on Steam. Go and download it. It's pretty damn good. Plus, you get to see Garolina. That's entertained at least two of my fans from the original days. On, on my notes here, it says, play as Henry. No, not Hans. You'd think it would be Hans, but no, it isn't. You have to help Hans find love with the one and only Carolina. And for those of you who love Farkle, there's lots of it. So that's good, actually. I love it for that, I'll be honest. And it's free until tomorrow. So, uh, good luck. Uh, get your hands on it. It's on Steam right now for 0p, so go download it immediately. I don't think there's many YouTubers who could say they're washed up Kingdom Come Deliverance YouTubers, but I'm at that point. I base my whole career around this game. And where has it left me? Well, it's left me with a bunch of pretzels that I don't bloody want. So I suppose I should actually talk about the game. Kingdom Come Deliverance one year later, two year later, and three year later do a lot better job than this. Um, so go and watch those videos as they're a lot more concise. And I hadn't lost the will to live by then. Um, <laughs> I do like to joke on the channel. It's fine. You see, this is called acting. I'm not actually angry. I am. I'm really angry. I'm so angry. The next video is going to be called Roxy Loses the Plot Five Years Later. <laughs> so does Kingdom Come Deliverance still hold up? Yes, it's bloody fantastic. Go and download it. It's on sale right now get your mitts on it. It's bloody fantastic. If you don't own it already and you're watching this video, why the hell are you here? I'll be honest, that's a bit weird. Go and buy it, then come back to this video. I don't know how much longer is left because I have nothing apart from the meme that I created with Toby sniffing soap. That's the only thing I can offer you in this video. Oh, hang on. No, we did hear about the Switch port. It's coming. Look, I'm going to be honest with you. So many people message me saying, Hey, Roxy, can you make a video about Kingdom Gun Deliverance four years later? Because, you know, you've done all of the rest. And I said, no. And then I was thinking, well, I kind of have to. People want me to make this video. Have you seen what this has made me into? Have you, have you seen what you've done? Because now 
I'm just ranting at a microphone. I'm not even talking to you. I'm just talking to an inanimate object about a game that I'm very passionate about. And after all this time, right, they still haven't hired me. At this point, I'm the world's best volunteer. I've promoted their game. I've talked about their game. I love their game. I made love to it once. That was a weird night. But at this point, I should be their head of marketing. So as we sit here reminiscing about the good old days, when there was actually something to talk about. Kingdom Come Deliverance is still one of my favourite games of all time and I love it and, and you should buy it. And if you haven't already, please, for the love of God, buy it. Because then <laughs> they may see that and go, oh, hang on a minute, Barry's just bought it. We need to make a bloody sequel. What are we waiting for? Good question. And at this point, the game is so fecking cheap that you'd be an idiot not to buy it. I don't really know what else to say. It's a bloody fantastic game. And uh, Warhorse, please, please announce something this year. Just something. It doesn't matter what. It could be Henry's nose for all I care. Just something, okay? Henry's nostrils coming in 2023. Look, at this point, I don't bloody care, right? Just something. Anyway, thank you for watching my very concise and informational filled video. I'm hoping Warhorse sees this and announces something soon. Otherwise, I'm heading to Prague and going to their offices and I will not be friendly. I will slap them with one of those gloves and ask them for a duel. Um, they don't have guns in the game, so they'd have to use spoons. But it would be something. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed my very concise and informative video about the best game that ever was and that didn't get a sequel for some reason. And I love each and every single one of you. Thank you very much for watching. I know this has been bizarre, uh, but hopefully I don't have to make another one. <laughs> this, this will hopefully be the last one. And then next year we'll be playing Kingdom Come 2. Right? Please? Oh, please. Pico, Pico the penguin, Pico, Pico the penguin, Pico, Pico the penguin, yeah! <laughs>